summertime goodbye neutrals and warm clothes and hello bright colors and skin out i for one wear those things all year round but the season is finally right for it and as usual pinterest is my source of inspiration my spring slash summer outfit board has been waiting for its time to shine and now it finally is so i thought why don't i bring that board to life pick out some of my favorite pieces and try to buy them <laughs> and try them on for you guys so today i will be thrifting my dream summer wardrobe Hello gorgeous people and welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, what's good? My name is Damasola and I really hope you like it here and I really hope you stick around. Make sure you subscribe, like and comment. In today's video, I will basically be thrifting my dream summer Pinterest wardrobe and I'm very excited about it because you guys know I love a shop, I love a haul and I love it when it's Pinterest inspired because two of my favourite things in one so I was very very excited so I have basically scouted my Pinterest boards for specific things to look for while going thrifting and obviously sort out those pieces and gotten them for you. So the main things that I wanted were nice summer dresses, colourful skirts, possibly a beach cover up, nice basics and nice nice trousers these are very broad but i wanted to make sure i had a lot of wiggle room for whatever it is i wanted to get so i went thrifting in here on preston i went to four of my favorite thrift shops and i brought you guys along with me so let's go this is a very unexpected vlogging day because i literally was looking for where to donate my clothes to on like for a different video <laughs> and i found out that my favorite thrift store in preston like this big warehouse place that we have is closing down and i am so sad but they're doing two for five pounds and i literally was trying to pick out outfits for a trip for another vlog <laughs> so i thought that i would insert me going there in this one so i'm actually gonna pull up and try and do some shopping nothing too crazy but since they're doing two for five i'm like there's no way i won't see at least six things that i like um six to eight is the goal first off we went to steels and steels is a giant warehouse that has a lot of stuff and they were closing down soon so they were having a two for five pound sale and i was very excited about it so we got there and as you can see it is a madhouse i spent at least an hour in this place sifting through trying to find good pieces but i had a great strategy i went rack by rack and focused on my size and went in the places that my size which is size 10 were disappointing i would also look at size 8 and size 12 and i saw a bunch of cute things i picked out about 12 items but afterwards i cut it down to eight because that felt like a magic number and second off we had british heart foundation which is in literally every city in the uk but i was very disappointed at the selection it simply was not giving i only saw about one dress that i liked and it was super short and it looked like it wasn't gonna look good on my body type so i didn't even bother getting it so um the hair was kind of a bust I mean, I combed through almost the whole store in five minutes because it is really small and I was being very fast. But yeah, the dress that I just showed is the only thing I really liked. British Red Cross and I really looked in here for something cute. And while they did have cute stuff, as I'll explain a little bit later, a lot of it was still just normal prices and I didn't feel like I was getting a bargain. I did see this really cute basic top that I did get, but other than that, nothing was really giving that five minute trip and i ended up getting one thing because it was just like a cute basic and i didn't really like anything else but the one thing is cute so well done this is my cross there were a lot of other cute things but um they were really expensive because i think they buy stuff from zara or i don't know they get um you know secondhand stuff from zara and then they just sell it for usually like a little bit less but obviously zara isn't the cheapest normally so the prices are still given no more <laughs> prices so yeah other than the zara stuff this thing i got was probably the only thing i really liked guys they're closed oh i'm actually really upset about that i don't know if when they close because they're not supposed to be closed till five so i actually don't know when to come back here i think we might just have to go with what we've got because like yeah i don't know when they close damn that kind of sucks and as you guys saw from that clip 
my trip to Hollywood exports definitely failed because they were not even open and I really wanted to film this video rather than go back and give them a shot because almost every time I've gone there I've been disappointed even though they were having an everything for five pounds it just did not seem like I was gonna find pieces that I would be obsessed with in there so at the end of the day we got about eight pieces from Steels and we got one thing from British Red Cross not my best in terms of range but I feel like the pieces I got were really cute so without further ado let me know talk your ears off let's get into these clothes okay guys so our first piece are these lined black wide leg trousers i will show you a full view on this side here and i really really love the fit of these like i love it when trousers um just you know hold your waist perfectly and like hug this hip to bum area but like flare out down below i feel like it's very cute i feel like it has all the perfect vibes and i feel like this is the type of thing you want in your wardrobe for summer because the material is really light and like thin i wish i could like <laughs> feel it for you guys and show you but it's not like normal um pants or denim material like it's very light it feels like the top sort of so like for really hot days it's very breathable and obviously the wide leg is very cute it's a basic that goes with absolutely everything so i feel like this is something that i'm gonna get a lot of wear out of this summer and i was actually saying that i wanted nice bottoms nice trousers like a pair with like cute little tops like this one and have it just be a look a vibe and still feel cute as hell i literally wore this to my brighton trip with like three different things and they looked so good with everything like i wore it with three different tops and every top served something different it was two pound fifty from steels and if that is not a steal i really don't know what it is our next piece is this sequin top it has like these um thin straps that are very stretchy and it has like this cow neck sort of effect and obviously let me come a bit closer the sequins doing their damn thing i think this top is so cute especially because you can dress it up but you can also dress it down like i wore this in a recent instagram post with a mini skirt and some heels and i thought it really gave i wore it to a drag bottom or well, it was supposed to be to a drag bottomless brunch you guys will hear the backstory to that in my next vlog i feel like if you wore this with like a longer fitted skirt it could definitely give like dinner vibes if you wore it with like jeans it could definitely give more casual vibes i feel like this would look really cute with some low rise jeans i feel like it would also look good with like any mini skirt or midi skirt even with these even though i wouldn't wear it with these i don't think it looks half bad at all this was also £2.50 also from steels also a size 10 oh i forgot to tell you guys that this is a size 10 as well i love things that feel like very versatile and like the events that you could wear them to. and i feel like when you get statement pieces it's good for them to be flexible statement pieces not something that you have to wear in a certain way every time and this is definitely giving that one thing i will say is i feel like if you were wearing this for an extended period of time you would get uncomfortable because obviously it's sequins and let me try and show you the inside of it that's kind of what it feels like so the sequins still kind of come through in that sense so it's not like itchy but i can see it getting itchy over like a certain period of time next we have this adorable pink slip dress also £2.50 also from steels and i just am obsessed with this you guys remember that blue dress that got my primark haul several months ago it literally gives me that vibe because it's also that satin material and there's something about things that are satin and like slip that make you feel sexy but also elegant and classy at the same time i just don't know i love the cow neck i love the color because y'all know pink is my favorite color <laughs> and i just feel like it gives so much i can imagine wearing this to so many different things i can imagine wearing it to like a cute show to a picnic on a date like once again versatility for the summer material is also very breathable extremely comfortable i actually feel like this type of thing that i could even go to bed in because can't like that's what slip dresses give sometimes sometimes they give nice like, gown but like in the hottest way possible i forgot to turn around for the last thing my bad and yeah i just feel like it is so cute and the fact that i got this for 250 thrifting is actually the only way forward and r.i.p steals i'm going to miss them so much i know it's a bit wrinkly right now but imagine it in its best form imagine it ironed imagine it because i obviously had to wash it and then yeah imagine it ironed imagine it you know ready for that night out i prepare this with so many things you wear this with fucking air forces we can also wear it with heels sandals slippers like versatility versatility our next item is this 
black halter top from British Red Cross, but I've checked the tag and it's originally from Shein. Um, I just think this is the perfect like halter top basic. And I've been looking for this for ages because I literally think I have like three halter top pictures or even more in that my spring summer outfit board. And I've kept this on button so you guys can kind of see where it reaches. So it's not like cropped or anything, but it does sit like right above your hips and like right below your waist or whatever and i just think it is so 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 cute i love the fit of it i did get it in an extra small um so that's probably like a uk six yeah in, and i made size 10 but i really i knew that it was a stretchy material and i really wanted this like tight fit that would make me feel really secure and everything and this is just like the perfect um so i feel like i could even pair it with these trousers that i'm wearing now and that's already a look i could pair it with just about anything like i feel like that is the theme of this haul specifically it's so comfortable a really nice fit i feel like the material is really nice as well i feel like it's something that will be in my closet for years and years and I wouldn't even notice this because it is just so, so cute. I love how like it lifts up the girls. I love how like it makes my waist feel small. I just love everything about it. I think it's very, very cute. It was $4.99, which is obviously more expensive than everything else in this haul. I won't even want to get like, huh. A British Red Cross is not usually the cheapest. <laughs> they usually have things that are like normal prices like I was saying with it, like their Sara stuff and everything but I still feel like $4.99 is a good price for this I'm not mad at it and that's probably how much it was on Shein as well or possibly even cheaper who knows <laughs> but it is for a good cause so I'm not that mad at it and I feel like it holds us up is it definitely a summer staple I would get this in white in black in pink in green every single color because i can just imagine all the looks that you could serve with this and it is giving this next piece is definitely one of my favorites i will put the full thing on the screen so you guys can get the full effect it is this gorgeous red slit dress oh my god and it has this like spotty um pattern i don't know if you guys can see it if you can't i'll put like a close up up there i just feel like this is absolutely adorable like you know when they say summer like this is giving summer even with this whole set up like i feel like i would wear this to so many places i'd wear this to brunch i'd wear this to lunch <laughs> i'd wear this to a picnic me and picnics but you guys might actually go on picnics every other week so <laughs> i would wear this to so many places literally even to like run around if i just want to feel like a body in my tesco trip i would wear this as well with some slippers anklets really get the whole vibe going i love this slit i feel like it's not ridiculously high but it's like in the perfect place where it's like risque but not too risque do you know what i mean the red is a gorgeous gorgeous color you know when they say summer that's what it's giving summer i'm so obsessed with it let's look at the back like get into it like just please actually I feel like it goes so well with this whole set top. Like this, this is an outfit. This is a look. This is something I would 100% wear. 8,000% in shorts. Like, please. I'm just so obsessed. Like, if you can't see from my energy, your girl is buzzing. It was £2.50 from Steels. But the brand, oh my god, if I don't say the brand, is because the tag is cut off. But this one, the tag isn't cut off, so it's from Love Own. I've never heard of that brand before, but they have cute skirts apparently, and it's in a size 10. 10 out of 10. Thumbs up from me. She is just. Mm -mm -mm. Did somebody say summer? Did somebody say florals? Did somebody say skins out? We outside. Like, Cottage core, ditzy, everything. It's giving absolutely everything. I am obsessed with this dress. This is one of my favorite aesthetics, guys. Um, I don't really know what to call it because it is in black, and usually these dresses are like in bright colors. But I just love this like ditzy, like very feminine, very cutesy style. It literally just makes me feel like I don't know, like a princess. I love this dress. Let me do the whole 360. But y'all, sorry, the braids are not really allowing it to be the most conducive today i feel like it is so flattering and so sexy while also being super cute like please get into it and this dress is so comfortable i love this like um bow detail like you can tie it and untie it i love the way the sleeves are and i love this like frilly thing at the bottom i think it fits my body really well it's in a size 10 and it's from steels i can't really the tag is cut off so i can't ascertain where it's originally from but i'm just 
absolutely obsessed i think it's so cute and you know how i was saying i wanted cute summer dresses i feel like this and the slip dress are definitely cute summer dresses and they give very different vibes and they are perfect like once again is this not perfect for a picnic i'm sorry but like the picnic bitch in me is really coming out because it really is like i am so obsessed i think it's so cute i love how it fits me i love how i feel in it like i literally just want to throw up did I say frolic? I want to frolic in like some kind of like lavender field or dandelion field or something. You guys should just watch out for all of these pieces on my Instagram because I'm gonna be rolling them out all season long. Like you will just be like, ah, is that not what she wanted in that hole that time? And I'll be like, yeah. I literally don't have any complaints. I feel like it is maybe slightly faded and like the black is not as sharp but obviously it is second hand so that's what you expect and i'm not mad at it at all i don't think it takes away from the just sheer adorableness of this dress and this outfit okay guys next up we have this gorgeous white bodysuit and you know how i feel about these type of bodysuits i love this um racer neck thing and the material is really thick so like i don't Feel like it's see-through or i mean i'm gonna see it in the in final clips but i don't feel like it's see-through at all i definitely feel quite covered up all things considered and i just think the fit of it is so good i feel really secure i feel like you guys know how i feel about basics and do you know the funny thing about me i used to be such a statement piece babe that now that i'm obsessed with basics is so weird so i'm very much pleased with this new development in my life i feel like it paired with this skirt i think it's giving all like the colorful trousers and skirts and any colorful bottoms that you want to pull out this will just go perfectly with it i i love it when i like outfits is set up like that so where you just need to add one thing to it and it's already elevated next we have this cute ass pair of white jeans and i've wanted white jeans for so badly for so long and i don't even know why i literally can't give you guys a clear reason i just feel like there's something very summery about them there's something very like because they are just normal jeans wearing white look at this outfit like it's already giving monochromatic body and that's a hint for a video that's coming up soon by the way <laughs> but yeah um i'm just so obsessed it has that perfect jeans fit that i love 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 where it's snug up here but then it flares out on the bottom i will do it side by side so you guys can get a better view and i'm just absolutely obsessed with it once again i compare this with so many things like one of my cute tiny tops is gonna go perfectly with it and if you're wondering how do you shop for jeans in like thrift shops big warehouses where you can't try stuff on my mom taught me this thing when i was younger I feel like a lot of African mothers do it as well. You basically take the waistband on your jeans and then you put it around your neck and if it fits your neck perfectly, it's gonna fit your waist perfectly. I don't know if there's like science to that and I don't know if there's lots of logic to it, but it has worked for me so far, can't lie. So definitely, and yeah, I kind of hate like going out of my way to try stuff on. It's just long. Sometimes I just wanna go home and like try my clothes on there, but I know that doesn't make sense. It's very comfortable. The quality of the denim feels really, really good. I don't know where it's from, but it was from Steel and it was £2.50 again the fact that I got a good pair of jeans two good pairs of like jeans you know that other one's not really jeans but yeah two really good bottoms for £2.50 I just feel like it's tough guys last but most definitely not least we have this mesh beach cover up the, bi the bikini is in part though this bikini is from like Shein from like two or three years ago I don't know it just felt right to try it on with this even though I wouldn't actually style it with this anyways <laughs> so it's like just a mesh cover up literally it's long sleeve it's like midi ish I'm gonna put obviously side by side on the screen it has like a cute little side slit right here and when I saw it, I was just like you know what I'm finding this in here because it just seemed like I don't think I've ever found a beach cover up in a thrift shop before like it just seemed like the most obscure thing to find but i really really liked it and i was like i just have to get it like you know when you see something i just have to get it like i just thought it was so cute the way i would style this is definitely with like a basic bikini like not one that has too many like bits and bobs and frills and stuff just like a basic triangle strap bikini definitely one in a bright color so i think like a red or an orange or a yellow because i feel like the this already does a lot so having a bikini that has like a lot of like bits and bobs and like patterns or like details and stuff it would just like be wasted because you wouldn't really get to see it see it under this but i feel like a bright color would definitely do really well under this because you would just see the color and that's all you need to see you know a holiday moment i know everybody is flying out even though my passport won't let me fly out but <laughs> yeah everybody that's flying out should definitely yeah, something like this i think it's so cute such a lovely gorgeous beach moment this obviously it was 2.50 it's from steels and it 
is in a size 10. I love the length of the sleeves because I hate like <laughs> dishwasher sleeves. I told you guys in that other video, I hate it so much. So I love it when they're like long and like they just hit your wrist perfectly. I really like the length of it. I like how it fits as well. I feel like if you want to obviously wear a bikini, but you don't want to be like popping out, popping out skin wise, um, this could be a really good thing to wear while still having that bikini look underneath but not showing off all the good probably next time i'm going to the beach i'll probably get the bikini to match and kind of wear it with this i don't think i would wear a white bikini because i just feel like what's the point it's doing nothing and that my friends brings our thrifting my dream pinterest wardrobe video to a very successful close this is probably one of my favorite shops i've done recently because i don't do like big shops that often and this was pretty spontaneous because i actually found out that this place was closing and i was like oh i remember I wanted to do this video might as well do it now <laughs> like literally and I feel like I found so many cute pieces for the summer and I'm just really excited about this summer because I get to wear all of these gorgeous things <laughs> like please I hope you guys liked all the pieces please comment down below what your favorite item was comment down below how you would style your favorite item alternatively and let me know if you like this type of video I want to see more videos like this I could do a part two for the summer I can make it a seasonal thing let me know what you are feeling in this sense um thank you guys so much for rocking with your girl <laughs> but as long as you have make sure you subscribe if you're new here if you like the vibes if you like to the clothes those are all here to stay so make sure you subscribe and get with it make sure you like this video if you liked this video and make sure you follow me on instagram to see how i wear these pieces over this summer i really love filming hauls y'all know this already <laughs> even when it doesn't work out <laughs> i still love them so yeah i'm really glad this worked out and i will see you all in my next video which is going to be real soon hopefully. <laughs> Bye guys.